of leaf code that is 1366 rank teams by votes so what we got over here is that we got five voters one two three four five right now those five voters trying to give vote for three teams why i'm giving three teams is that only we have three teams over here i can clearly see that abc not b e f something like that that's why i'm telling like five voters give ranking to three teams what about different use case okay we got four teams over here c w x y z and x y z w okay what about this one so we got those many teams but only one voter okay so now what we have to do is that we have to check who or which team got maximum vote by the voter that's all okay now let's see the simple example on this one okay now if we are going and checking the first ranking system over here the a came at the first position okay in this particular voter by this particular voter which means like this particular voter the first voter gave a as the first position first rank the second voter already given the rank to a as first as well third one as well fourth and fifth which means a will a got five votes whereas b and c got zero zero votes okay you got my point so we have to form a something an array saying that a okay for a we got five votes whereas b and c got zero zero vote now let's see in the second position how many votes b or c got okay now let's see about b b we got number of votes in second position one in second position two and that's all okay whereas b we got third position one third position two and third position three and same goes for c now we have to form or i would say tally number of votes based on the position of each team so how to do that so let, let me quickly comment it out like this so we got step one let's count it now let's i'm, I'm going to take this example as, as it is that votes abc the same thing and we will trying to print and or i would say form number of votes something like this okay so a got five times whereas b and c got zero times right voter one or something like that so b uh, got a uh, zero position a zero vote at first position but other voters give b as second position two times three voters give b as third position whereas c got second position by three developer uh, 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 voters and the same goes for c got third position by two voters okay so how to implement that one to do so what we can do we can check if and else condition saying that okay if we already got that voter counted we can put that into a dictionary and increment that dictionary one by one to doing so i've already implemented default dict from uh, the um, i imported that one from the collection data structure so if i go over here and then i can loop it through the anonymous function of lambda okay everything i got from zero then i'm gonna loop it through all the votes and rank it based on the enumerator and then add or increment that value one by one something like this and it will print an object of five zero zero b zero something which we were expecting over here right okay so the second step will be like we have to sort the team based on the tally in reverse order so we will consider that we will be having all the values which are which are those but in reverse order which means like okay we got five that's fine we got five everything and it's like three is greater than two right so this one the second position should come before the b right because c see the c the second index of c is greater than the first index of b 
so it should come over here so how to do that second let's sort that one in reverse order and we can do that one with this sort of method so we can sort it all the words based on the anonymous function in the dictionary minus order and the reverse it equal to true and it will print object something like this okay so we got a c b so we are getting only those values now a c b okay now we just need to join it i would say extract it and join it and if i go and run it all the test cases will be passed like that if i submit it we got a rank of 40 not a rank over there 47 milliseconds that is really good in run time memory is 12.24 that's really good so that's all thanks for watching if you do like my videos and simplest solution please do subscribe that makes me motivated and i'll keep posting you new videos which will be short and crispy thanks for watching